this is the video to show you the visitor counter in the um, click counter tracker script. So what I'll do is I'll log in and I'll show you how to create a visitor counter. Now the visitor counter can count visits to an individual web page or a set of web pages. Um, basically to create a counter, you can create as many different counters as you want. You say create counter, you choose an ID for it, so let's call it my counter. Any string of uh, alpha, uh, uh, alphabet characters or numeric characters to identi uniquely identify it. Choose a description, so let's call it um, uh, visitors to site X. The reason you might want to put a description is, for example, you've got multiple websites or different pages of the website that you want to track separately. Choose what you want to display, unique visits, which is um, every individual visitor. Total visits, which is, so if a visitor visits more than once, they count as two rather than one. Or unique and total visits will give you two numbers. It will track what, all of that information regardless of what you choose, or you can choose an invisible one. Let's have the uh, unique visits just an example. Click OK and it's created the counter. So my counter, visitor site X, this is what it will show. Total visitors, unique visitors, and this is what the um, code I would insert to display the counter on the web page. If I have an invisible one, it will be a tiny one by one pixel counter. Um, if I And I can change the counter details as well. I can delete or reset it, and I can show a detailed log of all the visitors to the counter. Obviously, there aren't any yet on that counter. But if you manage all my counters, you can see I've made one here, here earlier, which has actually had some visitors to its website. Uh, so if I click it here, it will tell me I've had uh, 1,429 unique visitors, 1,783 total visitors. So some people have visited more than once. That's why um, there's more total than unique visitors. Um, and if I um, scroll down, I can show the detailed log of that web counter, and it will show me the IP addresses and the date and time of a visitor. And it will show me, um, for example, unique duplicate IP. That visitor there visited uh, more than once, or this one visited three times in a row. Um, if I have other trackers click, set up, I can click on it, or I can click on any IP address, and it will show me all the visits by that IP address. In this case, two, one straight after another. Sometimes they'd be a long time apart. They might be on other trackers or counters as well, so I'd see them there as well. And that's it. It's very, very simple, very powerful. You can track all that information. Hope you enjoyed the video.